my Hellions, and welcome back to Dead Island. Woo! All right, so if you remember, we got Jean, our way into out. someone's coming. The prison. Quiet. Our friends, oh, they've come for us. Right. So if you remember, we made our way into the prison and um, uh, through the landmine and everything. My my equipment needs to be fixed. Holy shit. Um. And uh, we were helping Titus, like the head mad dog of the whole entire thing. And apparently mad dog wanted us to get some weapons. Well, while we were out there, I, of course this place is like an inter international prison. Like people with the baddest of villains send them here. And Titus was the ringleader of the entire shindig, eh, minus a couple of others. Well, that being so, he has a crew and several other people that's not in his crew don't like him. Well, apparently, they, the people that didn't like him um, decided to give him all-out hell for it, and they really don't like him. So they go off and they started shit, and all the screaming and fighting attracted a shit ton of dead, and these two beautiful babes, uh, a Latino and a chocolate babe, uh, decided to scootaloo during the entire, uh, feasting of the dead, more or less. Uh, and the only reason why I call them babes is because they're, like, the best looking female characters in the entire game. They haven't been bitten by sharks, they haven't been bitten by the dead, they have moderately good character models, no ass what to speak of whatsoever. But they're alive and they're not zombies, so that's an A-OK -okay in my book. So we're gonna talk to we're gonna talk to chocolate tits over here. All was quiet. And then everything went crazy. A mob of prisoners attacked Titus and his men, and then the undead came, attracted by the screams. Moen spirited us away and traded his boat to Alvaro so that he would tell us how to find you. He was helping us into a ventilation shaft when the dead got their hands on him and he sacrificed himself so that we could get away. There were too many. There was nothing we could do. They tore into him like hungry animals, and all we could do was watch. If not for Moen, we would not be here. Right, so she basically just retelled in better detail than I what I just said. So now, I think what we need to do is get the hell out of here. Or we need to, actually no, what we need to do is get out of this place, but find our way yeah, to the next, yeah. Get into the elevator. The elevator's here. I hate okay. the elevators. Now, take a second to catch your breath. <laughs> hey, what's with all the gas? What's going on? <laughs> what the hell? I don't like this shit. I hey, know. get up. Wake up. This ain't no time to be taking a damn nap. What happened? The fuck aghast us. I heard you talking to White. I'm the one who helped you open the locks. We gotta get the hell out of here. Like, now. And how do we do that? Since Colonel Trust Me just fucked us. You had something he wanted. He came in here and took it right off you like he knew just where to find it. The vaccine. What the hell? Well, that's just great. Told you we couldn't trust them. We gotta move. Come on. There's a chopper on the roof. It's waiting for White. And if that asshole reaches it before we do, he's flying the fuck out of here and calling in the bombers. Thermonuclear annihilation. The whole goddamn island. We gotta catch him while we still have a chance. What chance is that? White's headed to the hospital. He's picking up his wife to take her to the chopper. Being she's out of her goddamn mind, that'll take some time. He's going through the left wing. Not so many infected, but that's the long way. So what's the short way? Take the elevator to the top, which takes you straight to the other wing of the hospital. It's riskier, but we can reach the roof faster. Only the badasses should take the elevator. Me and the rest will take the safer way and meet you at the top. Shake a leg for fuck's sake. <laughs> well, you did say badasses take the elevator. So where's the elevator? The hospital wing. We'll take the low road. Anything good in here? Be Great. Careful. So we just got ass jacked. 
by the same dude that we were trying to help. Wait a minute. Vaccine. Why do I have a bad feeling that vaccine's not going to work? Like, why didn't they just try and make a vaccine out of our blood? Because, like, if think about it, they took a vaccine out of her blood. Not ours. We're immune. She's not. I mean, she took a little bit of cannibalism. She ate a few of the little bastards, and she was one of the lucky few that didn't turn. But she does have infected blood in her because she's from a tribe that practiced cannibalism. Okay? They... they The ones who survived became resilient but not immune. Which means... It's like a carrier but not a victim of, a, of, a, of HIV. You're a carrier of it, so it doesn't affect you, but you're and you're also not a victim. But at the same time, that means your blood's contagious to others. That would be her, but we're completely full-blown immune to it. Wouldn't that make that vaccine not work? Uh, I have a bad feeling about that damn thing. Why are we going this way? Why don't we just go straight to fucking... I'm gonna go up in here. What's in here? What's over here? Rifle ammo. Shotgun ammo? Ah. Uh, how's our shotgun ammo looking? I like our shotgun. Is there a repair spot? Yes, there is. Hot damn. Alright. Let's go this way. What's in here? Bunch of, bunch of bullshit. Okay. So now we need to find a way to the rooftop and fast. Oh, Military machete. Well, thank you. If we can find one more, I'll get an achievement from it. Well, now hold on. Why aren't we going upstairs? What the hell? Personally. Ah, damn. Ah, that's why we can't go upstairs. <laughs> Answered my question, didn't it? So what's downstairs? There's a bunch of blood. What's over here? Um, you're in deep. Gotta hop our way up the top. Eh. 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 There we go. Okay. Do we have rage? Do we have rage? No, we do not. But hey, you know what? It don't matter. So we'll just, uh, we'll just go and. Oh, fuck you up! Oh, shit. There we 
go. Ass wipe. Jesus fucking Christ. Malarkey. Oh my god. That was the most irritating bullshit I have ever played in this game. Minus the time I was going to the tips of city. Get your snack. Time to search around for secrets. Because that was actually very stupid. What's in here? Oh, nothing. Gotta reload my gun. size, but I know full well that you can't actually do shit. I don't know why I get scared by you. Or spooked by you would be the correct term for this. Apple. I want my apple. An apple a day keeps the bullshit away. Fuck. Oh, it's an automatic breathing. Wait, this is a hospital? Well, we are inside a prison, so it'd be... This isn't a hospital. This is the infirmary. Prisons don't have hospitals, do they? What have you been through here? What's over here? We've already been through here. Big fella! You know what? We're gonna go boop-kadoodle! 
emotions for you, because I'm having none of your emotion. I don't care if it was a waste or not. I'm not having any of your horse shit. Why are my fists raised? My character's acting like there's enemies around me. My character is acting like there was enemies around me. What the hell? Energy drink. Repair. Thank God for that. I have literally. Okay. Open says mummy. Just a few more of those. Recording. Uh, I've decided that I'm going to document the symptoms. Maybe my experience can help the it doctors don't pass figure up out what useful. this is. Okay. So, I'm hungry. I'm fucking hungry. Uh, a gnawing, burning, screaming need. So fucking painful, I can't even think. They're gonna see that I'm turning. I'm so sorry, Jacob. I'm so sorry. I'm working so hard to hold on to any thread of sanity. I can't even think, can't even remember what I'm trying to say. Ah, oh, why am I so fucking ravenous? I feel like my fucking skin is on fire, like, like someone is driving nails into my fucking forehead. Stop it, stop it. Jacob, hey buddy, why are you afraid of me? It's me, it's your dad. Jacob! Um. Okay. Hi, dude. Oh! Hi. Right. Ah, tits on me. shit's like not explained. <laughs> Still alive that's been transformed, or 
are they dead and then their bodies are reanimated? Like, that, this kind of makes me wonder. I kind of wonder if it's actually just if they are still alive because you don't have to kill them by cutting off their heads like you normally would you can just like shoot at them and eventually they'll die like is that what it's supposed to do Hi, bitch. Chapter 18 now. Oh, cool. What? Oh, we're on. Whoa. Why are we up here? What the hell? Who the hell? How the hell? Uh. Oh, shit. That's a lot. Uh. I can't repair you. Really? I can't repair it? Buddy, this ain't good. Is this it? Down. Ah! Ah! What the 
hell? Let's hope there's something useful. Okay, I'm can fuckle. Do I need to... There's someone over there shooting at me, I don't like it. Ouch! Dude, you suck. Ass! Get over here. What's over here? Oh, shit. Hey! Oh, there's more of you. Whoa, frame rate? What are you doing here? Oh! Oh, yeah, that one. Damn it. I'm a shit shot. Hit him in the head! There you go. Dumbass. You're too late. Emily and I are flying out of here, and you'll stay behind with no bloody chance of escape. There we go. You think you can stop me? I was always one step ahead of you. Are you sure about that? Ah! Oh! oh, oh. Ah! And I'll slew you! Ooh, and I'll slew you. Come on, pop your head out. Pop your head out. Show daddy them titties. Show daddy them titties. I did not need to use that. Are these the type of humans that you can't just shoot in the head and they instantly die? It's kind of stupid. For you to go. Come on, pop your head up. Damn it. Come on, I'm hitting him. There you go. Come on, where are you? Come on. Damn it. Okay, whatever. We'll just uh, take that. Go over here and raid this and reload this. What's in here? Nothing. I can't seem to do anything.
grand idea, wasn't it? <laughs> that was really smart. <laughs> Hold on now. Come here, buddy boy. Yeah, that hurt, huh? This is like the first time me ever using a gun. Get out of my face, bitch. trying to do, Connell? I don't have to explain myself to you. Look, your wife is gone. Look at her. She ain't coming back. But you can still save Take us. Take one more step and you're dead. I have the cure, all right? The doctors in Sydney will make more. We'll send helicopters. We'll save everyone. With a nuclear bomb? Kevin told us the plan. You're gonna kill everyone. Maybe I should start with you. I have no choice here, right? This virus threatens the entire bloody world. Benoit is lost either way. It's easy to kill millions of faceless nobodies, isn't it? Stay back! They hardly seem human! Stop! But killing someone you love? It's not so easy, is it? Ah! Oh. Son of a bitch! Oh, come on! Why'd you... I knew that vaccine was a bad idea. Oh, Ooh, you're a biggin. You're a biggin. Boop time. Boop time. Oh, you're a raging booper. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. Who's got bigger fist, bitch? I do. I got bigger fist, asshole. Boop. Boop, you doodles. <laughs> that was easy. See, this is this is how you. He was right about one thing. Benoit is lost. If not him, then someone else will soon send a nuke with our name on it. The quicker we leave, the better. Okay. That was easy. The zombies were harder than him. You just gotta go boop mode. Boop Kadoodles just kills them all. Oh, well, wait a minute. We, got, we learned the plan from, from Kevin, the, the, Come on. the inmate that we're doing here. We lost Jen, so that sucks ass, but how did he know about the plan? According to officials, Benoit is still under quarantine. The sought-after vacation destination, popular with celebrities and wealthy tourists alike, was ironically, originally, a penal colony, and still houses one of the strictest maximum security prisons in the world. It is home to many dangerous criminals and terrorists, including Karen, the infamous hacker for hire who has worked for everyone from Al-Qaeda to the Yakuza. Meanwhile, news of the lethal virus on the island has caused a worldwide panic. Some have claimed that the virus is only the first wave of a massive international terrorist attack, and that the intentions are global. Bernard Green, spokesman for the Australian Defence Force, denies the claims. There is no basis for these ridiculous rumors. The entire island is under military quarantine, and the maximum security prison is completely secure. The hacker known as Karen, and every other terrorist in prison there, isn't going anywhere. Humanitarian aid is on its way, and you can be sure that the virus, or whatever it is, will not leave the island. The whole world anxiously watches what is happening in Benoit. For the moment, all flights in and out have been cancelled. Oh, shit, man, I can't believe we made it. At this point, I'll be goddamn glad to have all my old problems back. As long as the world is the way it used to be. It's not. And never will be. What does that mean? 
Trust me. So, is Yarin or whatever the hell her her name is, the tribal woman, is she up to something, or is the or is the hacker dude with us? Or, or what? what or, which, I have a bad feeling about either one of them. More about the inmate than the tribal girl. Okay, well, there, that was that was the end of it. Okay, well, that was uh, Dead Island. Um, White skin. It's also Sam B in the background singing this little voodoo bullshit. Bangs like a bump in the night. Me. Uh, Sam B. <laughs> Shrunkity. Right, okay, so we'll just cut that out for him. Alright, so that was Dead Island. Um, it's a fairly good game. I liked it. The open world is, is nice. Originally it was made in, oh, eight oh nine oh ten somewhere in there it was uh, it was pretty good and uh, this is a definite edition so supposedly this is its remastered version now the unfortunate part is that even though it is a remastered edition that came out in like 014 015 its graphics has not really been upgraded and if it has it's been poorly done so in comparison to what could have been done or for a remastered edition what would have hoped to my knowledge they didn't add any quests at least they didn't add a well they might have added a player playable character um but there is also a um, uh there is also a uh a arena dlc i think i don't know we'll, we'll go back to the main menu here in a second see what's check all that out but uh, Rundown basically is, this game has stamina. That was the biggest issue I had with this game. Like, I could not fight. It was the biggest drawback in this game, aside from the fact that your weapons broke so damn easy. Like, some weapons actually stayed together, stayed together pretty good. Like, it was, it, it was really good. But the stamina was the biggest issue in this game the biggest issue i mean the graphics that that to be expected but was kind of hopes up for it um it, it i i feel like it has a, for a remastered edition it had a lot of room to improve on that they could have capitalized on and they didn't but the story was good the voice acting was good the animation it, a little bit off sync, okay. But it was fun. It was fun. Uh, this game with mods could even be more fun. Um, but it, I think its biggest drawback is the stamina. But if you can ignore the stamina, of course there may be skills that allow you to increase your stamina. Um, but if you can get past that, then this game's actually really fun. I'm going to leave this one here for now. Uh, I know this is kind of a shitty end, but I kind of wanted to save that for later. Um, accidentally started something I didn't really mean to. And uh, what I wanted to do was actually go find the uh, the the campaign. Or not the campaign. Ah, what the fuck is it? I wanted to go see the Bloodbath Arena, which we may not actually end up getting to, unfortunately. But, hey, that's okay. It's basically nothing more than just going around the arena and trying to survive wave after wave after wave of zombies. But anyway, I'm going to leave this one here. Thank you, everybody, for watching. If you guys liked it, hit that like button. Give us some love. Go over to subscribe and subscribe to become a Helion of the family. And also to help the family grow. And when this family hits 100 Helion strong, I will be doing a giveaway of five plus prime parts sets on the game free to play it is named warframe yes warframe a uh, free to play game that's actually really good i've played it for quite a few years it's really nice i like it and i will be doing a giveaway on it i have collected quite a few uh <coughs> coughs apparently as well as prime parts prime sets and uh, in order to take part in this giveaway merely just subscribe 
leave a comment down below on the video that will that I'll that I'll name not this one but when I do the giveaway I will be making a video specifically for it and in order to do it all you gotta do is subscribe and on that particular video okay all you have to do is uh, put out your master rank doesn't matter uh, it doesn't doesn't matter what your master rank is just put it out there and your in-game name of Warframe and bing bada boom you're eligible for the giveaway so on that note ladies and gentlemen thank you everybody for watching and as always I will see all of you in the next one toodaloo